Hello and welcome back to Song Reaction Analysis with your girl JVB. First and foremost, as always, thank you so much for being here on my channel, checking out my reactions as well as my own music. All the links are in the description below. I hope you're having a great summer so far. If you haven't yet and you've been coming here, hit the subscribe, like, notification bell so you never miss a post of mine. I have to remember that, so don't, don't forget to do that. We had a request. Seiki, am I saying that right? Please. Correct me if I'm saying it wrong, Seiki, I'm thinking. Her solo performance, um, Choose Me. I love Bandmate and I'm excited to hear her singing solo on the piano. <laughs> She's got a beautiful vibrato. I love that. I go so on and many me and I can so I am not a super desarakeda. She can really belt it and I love when she goes in and out of falsetto, goes into her head voice a little bit, coming back out and going down to the lower nose and really very dynamic, you know. There is like a, a blend of belt, of head voice and falsetto in there and even a little chest voice. She goes back and forth and the way she transitions is just so beautiful. And I love that's like definitely like a real like live performance to it, you know, where she, she's using a lot of breath <laughs> and she's not running out of breath. She never sounds out of breath, but she sings a lot and has very small spaces to like, even like sip and take a little sip of breath. Right. So that's why I call it just like, like take it in just a little bit. Um, and I love the way she's choosing where she's choosing to do that, but her voice is beautiful and she plays the piano, which I didn't know. Really impressive. Very, very good. I want you attention.
It's nice because, you know, singers, especially in a metal band, sometimes you don't understand the voice so well. So I love that you can actually understand her, just her and the piano. So that's absolutely beautiful. Um, she has a beautiful voice and she has a nice range too. And I like when she goes again, like switches, you know, goes transitions through her registers and it's very flawless and has a lot of emotion behind it. And just the fact that she's like sitting in front of a piano and playing and singing, you know, no matter what, mad respect. To do that, I always have mad respect for anyone who does two things at the same time because, you know, when you do one thing, you have to be 100% at it, right? So when you're doing two things, you have to be 100% at the piano, you're 100% with your vocals. So that's not always easy. Um, even though obviously you you know, you know you are uh, accompanying yourself, but sometimes the piano line is a bit more complex than your vocal line. So that it's not always exactly, you know, you're playing the exact chords that you are singing. So mad respect, I love it. It was very emotional, it was very uh, beautiful and very skillful. I loved it. It's a long song. And she did really, really well, and she did some long phrases, and her breath control is amazing, her range is amazing, and just her whole overall performance style is really adorable. I love it. And she's very, very, she seemed very vulnerable. People that have a band or front a band, sometimes they're really comfortable in front of a band, but they may not be as comfortable by themselves. So she did an amazing job. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I did. We have to actually do some more bandmate reactions as well. So in the comments below, Give me some suggestions and recommendations. I had a whole list that I made and then my laptop, that specific laptop just died on me after coming back from a, a flight. It got destroyed. It got like damaged. And so, yeah, anyway, my screen was broken at first and now everything is gone. <laughs> Thank God I backed up most of it, but I did not back that up because that was my last work and I just didn't think that anything could happen to it. So always back your stuff up. With that said, I'm gonna let you go leave it with something uplifting and positive. As always, make every day a great day. And just know that my life's been a little bit crazy as of late. And, uh, you know, it's easy to say, why? Why me? Why is this happening? What else could happen? Never say that, by the way. When you say what else could happen, the universe is like, oh, you want some more chaos? Here you go. So try not to say that, even though sometimes it's easy to say, especially when you get a little frustrated and angry and just like, I, I was just really, honestly, I, I almost lost my shit. I was like, why is nothing working? I need to work, you know, but um, then I just like tried to just relax. And you know, it's okay to feel your anger. It's okay to feel your emotions. But like, we just like try to not stay in that for too long and get to the whole victim mentality. Just like know that, all right, what can I, how can I solve this problem right now? No matter how much or how little money I have, resources I have, whatever I need, you know, that can fix the problem. How can I work with what I got right now? So with that said, Hope that helps a little bit because I know like I am not perfect and I, I get, you know, I get angry. I, I'm, I'm very tem temperamental sometimes. So like I do yoga and Kundalini yoga helps me actually a whole lot. I can totally see the difference when I do yoga and when I don't do my yoga because when I do my yoga, I'm way more balanced. I'm way more chill and, and more in, in, in tune you know, with my frequency versus being bombarded by all the outside noise and energy that we need to self protect ourselves from because it's, it's really a lot sometimes. And when you feel sometimes the whole world is on your shoulders, it can be that you're just like really receptive to that at that very moment. And that can be pretty intense, you know. So make sure that you do like a little ritual in the beginning of the day and in the in the evening before you go to sleep and then again in the morning when you wake up to kind of protect yourself your aura your energy you know and also like who you surround yourself with really important um because energy is is contagious you know much love if you haven't yet make sure you hit the like subscribe notification bell so you never miss a post of mine and i will see you in the next one